Hi friends, in today's episode we'll be making video games for lazy eye and vision training. We'll be taking this classic Nintendo DS game, Flash Focus, updating the graphics and gameplay. Watch until the very end to see the special features we've added for lazy eye and vision therapy. So let's get started. Flash Focus breaks down the game types into the following. Dynamic Visual Acuity, which is the ability to see moving objects. Momentary Vision, the ability to process a lot of information at once. Eye Movement, the ability to move your eyes quickly. Peripheral Vision, the ability to see around your central vision. And Eye Hand Coordination, the ability for your eyes and hands to work together. Dynamic Visual Acuity is the ability to track moving objects. Like this game, your goal is to track the circle. This skill can be applicable in sports and improve your ability to track objects. We took this idea and revamped it with spheres and stars to look something like this. And just for fun, we added a more complex version of this game by adding multiple targets that are moving as well. Momentary vision looks something like this. We'll flash a lot of information at once and you'll have to process it. In this case, there are a bunch of letter C's arranged in different orientations. And among them is a circle and your job is to find that circle. Similarly, here's another example of a momentary vision game. Your objective is to count all the C's in that exact orientation. Eye movement, which involves moving your eyes quickly. Here's an example. In the game symbol order, you need to move your eyes quickly to see the symbols that are shown. Then repeat the sequence of the symbols. Peripheral vision is your ability to see around your central vision while gazing at the center. In this game, you focus on the symbol in the center, then use your peripheral vision to spot the same symbol on the outside. Eye-hand coordination, the ability for your eyes and hands to work together. Flash Focus had a basic game where you would tap boxes that appear on the screen, like whack-a-mole. We revamped ours to look a little more 3D with flowers that sprout out of the ground. On top of that, we added an additional objective, tap only the flowers that have the letter C in the correct orientation. These are the five visual abilities covered in Flash Focus, with many more games that we revamped that we didn't even get a chance to cover in this video. Moving on to our bonus feature we added into our games to make them helpful for lazy eye and vision therapy. It's called MFBF. This technique trains each eye independently while still using both eyes together. Here's an example. This might look like a regular game, but with red-blue glasses, some targets can only be seen in one eye, and some can only be seen in the other. This technique trains each eye independently while still using both together. You'll have to use both eyes together in order to play the game. MFBF promotes eye teaming and binocular function, which helps with depth perception and can be a game changer for various visual issues. If you want to play our revamped Flash Focus games with MFBF, you can play it for free on our Optics Trainer app, available on iOS and Android. For our clinics, these games and MFBF features are also available on our Optics Trainer eye tracking system. If you like this content, don't forget to like and subscribe. And if you like games and vision therapy, check out our last video here.